Hi everyone, welcome back for another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm here right in Lightroom Mobile, and I must admit, it's absolutely fantastic. And we can do quite a lot. Uh, sometimes people they go like, "Can I do this? Can I do that?" Well, I'm going to process this image of a sunset that I a photo I took last year, and I'm going to do it process it entirely here in Lightroom. So as you can see, I've got here edit. And edit would be like the basic panel in either Lightroom or even Camera Raw. Uh, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to white balance. And you may see a dot, a red dot, it's where I put my finger in. So it might be easier for you to follow through. So I'm going to shade as, a white, as my white balance. And now I'm just going to add some contrast, like so. And I'm going to obviously bring down the highlights quite a lot. And open up the shadows just a touch something like so so i have a bit more detail on the rocks um but the sky is still too overexposed so what i'm going to do is i'm going to drag a graduated filter and even though it doesn't say here graduated filter in like the mobile i'm going to click selective and as you can see right here on your left we've got graduated so i'm just going just to drag graduated like i would in Lightroom on the desktop version so there you go and I'm going to bring down the exposure so and the contrast so it's quite a bit more punchy so in the highlights as well and it looks very cool so I'm going back to my basic panel which is the edit and I've got my histogram right here and uh, but I'm going for my whites add a bit more whites and make sure I've got some nice blacks like this and of course clarity but i'm just going to about 30 something awesome so now what i want to do is i want to come here on the left and where my finger is and as you can see we've got lens correction profile correction oh yes please i've got dehaze mm, why not so let's click dehaze and oh very cool and now I can go for color, black and white, split toning, vignetting, tone curve. Let's go for tone curve. And tone curve, as you can see, I can do it via different channels, blue, green, red, or RGB or Prometric. I'm just going to point RGB and I'm just, just going to do the, the normal S curve. Something like, oh, it's too strong. Something like this. Yeah, looks cool and back to my edit and i think it looks rather rather good well so i'm going to my presets and add some detail and i'm going to detailed and i'm good to go that's it a very cool image well warm image because it reminds me of summer and summer holidays uh, it was a fantastic evening this evening when i sh shot this image and as you can see that's before and that's the after, before and after, all done in Lightroom Mobile. You can do it either on your iOS or Android device, tablets or phones. So absolutely fantastic. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and share the video with your friends. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye for now.